So first and foremost, I want to thank Mr. Schiffert for having me here today. Since I met him about a year and a half ago, he's been a very important part of helping me share my message with young people, namely you guys here today. I'm Chris Shifford. I'm principal at Whitehall High School in Whitehall, Pennsylvania. I just wanted to say a few words about Charlie Brenneman, the, uh, the Spaniard. Uh, I've gotten to know him over the past year or so, forging a relationship based on who he is, what he presents to kids, and obviously my role as a school principal. If that is not your ball game, if that is not your arena, what I do, what I did for a living, what I'm going to share with you is far exceeds what you just watched on the screen. It's, it's going to touch on areas of your life that no matter what you get into, the principles, the three keystones of success. Charlie's someone who's, I think, in a perfect spot with based on his experiences, his career, where he's at with things. He makes a, a true, legit connection with, with students. SR. Senior. Senior. Not senior, not sir, but what? Senior. Espanol, yeah. I used to be a Spanish teacher. We had a presentation today where I, I saw kids really focused on him and listening, and I think they they're piqued by his initial piece of being a, a, a fighter, but then they start to really absorb what he's saying and his principles and how to be thinking ahead and being, uh, you know, showing your integrity, being accountable. These are things that he talks about, and that's real. So if you do more things than the average person, if you try more daring, more adventurous, more uh, significant tasks, chances are you're going to fall short more than the average person. If you don't try anything, you're never going to fail. He was very yeah, real, right. and he put life experiences in with it. And he wasn't like one of those boring speakers. He put, he was funny, and he would sometimes drift off, and he was, it was good. Let me just hear a short one or two sentence definition of accountability. Go for it. Where you own your decisions and what you do. What is your name? Brianna. Brianna, you just took away five minutes of my presentation. <laughs> Uh, the talk was actually really good because of how genuine he was. He actually spoke about, like, he went on certain tangents where he was, like, telling us real-life experiences, and he even got emotional at one point, so we just felt like we were having a conversation. It wasn't, like, rehearsed. It wasn't. So I boiled it down to three keystones of success, three areas of my life, of your life's lives, that you can walk out of here, you can start implementing today. That of leadership. That of accountability, a huge one especially with high school students, and that of integrity. Uh, I also liked how we applied his beliefs to um, hobbies that are outside of MMA, such as theater, such as music, such as no, art, anything you want to do. I really feel like he pushed the boundaries as to connecting with the audience. Another one of my principles is avoiding negativity. It's out. It's gone. Now, everything that's taking away from my vision of what I want to be, get it out. He's a real testament to trying to find those balances uh, in life, and, and kids can take something away from what he's saying. If you're looking for a speaker, I highly recommend him, and I'd be more than happy to, you know, uh, share my experiences with him. He's he's done a great job in, in working with us and our students here at Whitehall.